team to Shay. So I just got back home and I just changed into my new outfit. Your girl is Adidas from head to toe. Big reveal of what I am doing for my date. Stay tuned. Can I just say thank you so much, Steph, for literally beating my face to the gods. Let's just do a montage really quick. Steph, girl, you have some real life talents. I sat there and watched you do it, and I am still confused on what you did, girl. All right, guys, so I think that I built enough anticipation for tonight's date. The cat is about to be out of the bag. Are you guys ready? Well, here's the truth. Really, I don't have a date tonight. You guys are my date. <laughs> we are going to watch a movie on the couch. You guys don't understand. I have not had any time for myself, for me time, and to be able to just sit down and just watch a movie on my couch. So you guys ready? Let's go to the living room. You guys, I don't think that I'm gonna be able to finish the entire movie. I really don't think that you guys understand how excited I am for right now. You guys, this is the best date so far. It's, it's going so well. I have never been so relaxed and so comfortable on a date. Hunty. Fact about Touche, this literally is my favorite spot on the kitchen. What? I really just meant to say this is my favorite spot on the couch, but don't mind me right now. I'm just so happy. Sam, we searched the entire house. There's no one here. We had an open house here a few days ago. Maybe someone found a spare key laying around her. Maybe someone stayed. Probably just some kids trying to scare the newcomers. Didn't feel like kids. What's that? Hey! Hey! Something is clearly going on. Hello? Is anyone there? That's always nice to know you have someone nearby. The quiet out here can get real wild. think should we watch the open house i think i'm with it i just hope it doesn't scare me i'm by myself who am i gonna hold on to y'all gonna keep me safe if i get scared team touche woke up this morning so rejuvenated refreshed i had an amazing date with you guys thank you so much for coming over and spending time with me i forgot to show my snacks but um you guys, I fell asleep on the movie, so I'm gonna have to make another video on a recap of how that movie went. But comment below if you watched it and if you like it. Guys, I am back in the kitchen, so stay tuned for what's coming next. This is so random and off topic, but I woke up this morning to a million views and over 30,000 subscribers, and that literally happened overnight. Thank you so much, guys. I love you so much. Like, you guys almost brought me to tears. I promise to continue to bring you more recipes and let me know what you'd like to see next.
Team Touche! Thank you so much for tuning in for today's video. I hope that you guys liked today's recipe, which was my vegetarian meatless, soy-free, gluten-free chicken cutlet. I served that with sauteed baby spinach, and I also served that with a Southwestern veggie blend. Make sure you try that at home. I hope that you like it. So what you guys have all been waiting for. I feel like I answered the question in my last video, but I do apologize if I was not clear. I do also wanna apologize for if I offended anyone, that was not my intention at all. I just really wanted the negativity to stop. I understand that it's always going to happen. However, it's like the Ace Family is such a positive YouTube family that I feel fans should be the same. I wasn't trying to bash anyone at all. I'm telling everyone to stop bashing me, so why would I start bashing people that's completely opposite of what I'm going for? I said that I wanted to be positive to make that clear. I also wanna make a few other things clear. When I said that I gave everything up to be the Ace Family Chef, then why after a month would I leave for personal reasons? I think that you guys misconstrued what Catherine said. She didn't say whose personal reasons it was. However, you guys are trying to dig, dig deeper into it, and I completely understand, but it's really not that serious. Nothing happened. Honestly, it wasn't my personal decision to leave the Ace family. But when I said that it was a shock, it was a complete shock. So that's what took so long for me to finally respond because I didn't know what to say. At the end of the day, like, it's really no one's business. Here's your answer. No plain, honest, truthful, and 100, and it's not clickbait. I really was shocked. You know, I also wanna make something very serious clear. I have been seeing a couple of people say that I'm no longer the chef because something happened between Austin and I. That is not true at all. You guys like, you literally go to like the lowest, like in over the top, conclusions of why I'm no longer the chef. Catherine said personal reasons, can you guys just leave it at that? I can't answer that, I'm not sure. Please don't start bashing me and putting my name in the dirt. And don't get offended by me saying this. But you guys are insane for thinking that me and Austin had anything going on. I really need you guys to clear that out of your brains because you guys that are saying that are the reason why couples don't put their relationship on media. Saying that I'm trying to be with a married man, a happily married man. You guys are insane for thinking that, honestly. Like, you guys are literally like trying to make other people's lives difficult. Better yourself. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope that you guys love today's recipe. Make sure that you like, you comment, and you subscribe to get a chance to win $100. I'll see you guys tomorrow.